hi everyone this is Larry computer tutorials welcome as usual in this tutorial we're going to be looking at constants and variables in basic programming so in this lesson we are going to be defining the meaning of constant and how we can use it in our basic program I'll be telling you the meaning of variables and how it can be used in a basic program so what are constants? They are quantities that cannot be changed during the execution of a program. There are two types of constants, the numeric constants and the string constants. Now, as you can see, the examples are given here. These are examples of string constants. Now, let's look at ways of declaring constants in basic programs. Example 1. When we consider a basic statement like this, having let b equals to 78, this means that during the execution of the program, the value 78 will be stored in the location B and whenever B is being referenced the value 78 will be presented another way of doing that is by using this let statement let B dollar sign equal to boy so whenever B is being referenced in the program the B string will be supplied as boy another example is by using the read and data statement using the read and data statement meaning that whenever a is being referenced in this program 89 will be presented as the, as the value of a and com will be presented as a value of b string the third example i want to give is by using the let statement again but well, this time we are going to be using it to add two numbers together meaning that whenever c is being referenced the value of this addition 5 and 6 will be presented as a value of C. Now let's talk about variables. Now a variable, this is a name that represents numeric quantity or a string that can be changed during the execution of a program. Examples A, N, J, P, 2, X, 4, K, dollar, J, dollar. Now in declaring a variable in basic program, you have to make use of the input statement and for example you have this input a you have input b input a dollar we have um, input a b and c dollar so here the input statement can be used to just one input statement can be used to um, um to to get the values of many variables so instead of separating them as a b and a dollar you can actually have something like a b c dollar and so on as many as you want then let's move on now during the program execution what you will notice is that a window like this will be displayed asking you to provide the value of the variable you have supplied with your input statement so all you need to do is supply the variables and press the enter key and your result will be displayed so in this lesson we have been able to look at two things we have been able to look at the meaning of constants and how they can be used in basic programs we have been able to look at the meaning of variables and how they can be used in basic programs thank you for watching see you in the next video